Happy day, we've made it to the last section. So 5.0, troubleshooting, which is 22% of the CompTIA Cloud Plus certification exam for CV0-003. So uh, this section, specifically we're gonna do the subsection 5.1. Given a scenario, use the troubleshooting methodology to resolve cloud-related issues. And so 5.0 has six sections, six sections. So this is the first section. And it's really easy because it's just one slide. So this won't be long. So I should introduce you, make sure you know that we're getting this right from the exam objectives, okay? Um, given a scenario, use the troubleshooting methodology to resolve cloud-related issues. So first, and and for some reason, people like to, to think that the, well, they want these in the specific order. Um, sometimes... I've seen practice questions on other exams that ask you what what order was it or what's one closest to or just weird things. So um, so identify the problem. So when you're identifying the problem, you're questioning the user, um, asking about changes, and then performing backups before making any changes inquire regarding the environmental or infrastructure changes and the sad thing is a lot of times what's changed is time as time marches on things happen um, maybe something fills up maybe it yeah there's a lot of different things that can happen with time um, but other times there, the, there's information that really helps you identify the problem there so from the information that you have, establish a theory of probable cause. So question the obvious. Um, so often people come and say, hey, this is the problem and I've already done this. And I'm like, well, can you help me see what you've done? And we go to look and we find the problem um, immediately in something that they, th they, they think they've checked. Um, because people... Uh, assume things and sometimes they assume it wrong but they think they've checked it um, if necessary conduct external or internal research based upon the symptoms depending on where you're at with that um, they might not let you do external research so um, they they may have an air gap between you and the internet so you it, you can't research things because um, of security reasons uh, but most places, that's not the case. So being able to try and find out what the problem is by looking at external resources using, uh, I refer to Uncle Google uh, or anti-YouTube, like you're looking at right now. So uh, test the theory to determine uh, the cause. So uh, try and find out if you're right. Um, and it, when the theory is confirmed, determine the next step. So... If it's not confirmed, think of another theory or escalate, ask for help. Um, too often I see people troubleshooting things cause more problems uh, because they think they've got it. And um, they just, they don't realize that they're in over their head. Um, establish a plan of action to resolve the problem and implement the solution. So... Uh, make sure that whatever you do is within the the bounds, the authority that you've been given to do. Uh, don't step outside your bounds. Otherwise, escalate and get permission, right? Um, verify full si uh, system functionality and, if applicable, implement preventive measures. So even though you've now resolved it, or at least maybe made it so it's not as big of a problem right now. What caused it? Is there something that you should do right then to try and prevent this from happening in the future? Once again, sometimes you should take that to a larger group um, so that you don't make mistakes uh, if it can wait. If it can't wait, uh, document it well. Um, document your actions, the outcomes, the process, and whatever else you've implemented to help prevent it and make sure that the, the organization is, is pleased with it. 
So once again, remember them in order. Identify the problem, establish a theory, test the theory, establish a plan of action to resolve, verify full functionality, uh, full system functionality, and implement pre uh, preventive measure, measures if needs be, and then document. Okay. Anyway, we'll see you in the next video.